What's going on, YouTube? We have another OP04 Locals gameplay match over here. Blue Crocodile versus Green Purple Doflamingo. Crocodile's going second. Four Don turn. Swing leader. And I'm going to 3,000 worlds, the Nami. We don't want him generating any resources from that. Five to leader, gonna take that. And he plays out Diamante, which basically is a mini kid that kinda can attack, and if he has a Don attached, will we stand at the end of the turn? Six Don turn, perfect for Sentamaru. Going to attach one, pay two, summon out a Pacifista. Just did a quick check of the deck, see if any triggers are in life. All right, so this is right back to Doflamingo, seven down turn. This should be his Luffy turn. A after he plays Luffy, he is safe from Mihawk just because I'm going to eight down after. Doesn't look like he has the Luffy. He's going to play the Nami for three, search for one. So now he has three down left open. He's going to swing with the Diamante for 7,000. And I trigger into a Red Rock, bottom decking that Nami. And the reason I bottom deck it is I also have another one in hand. But, as, but also I don't want to spend six down next turn. So I'm at eight. This would be a great time to play out a Soga King to bounce that Diamante, get that tempo back. But I do have 3,000 worlds. So my hand is pretty stacked with removal. And with the four down left, I can use my Sentamaru to Search for another pacifista. Gonna attack first. He gets a trigger. His leader is plus 2,000 now, so his leader is 7,000. So my attacks won't really do anything. So let's cheat out that pacifista. Get more board presence. and just swing seven, try to draw another card out of his hand. I'm okay just swinging just because he doesn't have board to clear my mine. So at least this way I'm taking cards out of his hand. And he's one turn away from playing 10 drop Doflamingo. He's at nine Don. So 7,000 to the Centamaru, which is the perfect blocker just because it got all its value already. Uses the seven Don, plays the Luffy, and cheats out a Uta. Now if I have the Mihawk, that'd be a perfect time to bottom deck the Luffy. I don't, but a Soga King is a is the next best thing, so I'm gonna bounce that Uta back to hand. Draw two, cycle some cards. I'm gonna toss out some event cards because they don't have counter. And I do plan on using all my Don the next few turns. Three Don left, I can kind of just swing with everything and draw even more cards out of his hand. So three Don, play an all, miss all Sunday to let me recycle some of those events that I tossed out already. So there are one of each of the events. So there is the 3000 worlds, the Red Rock, as well as the Dragon Twister. So I'll have some options. And there he goes, plays down the 10 drop, freezing my two pacifistas as well as leader. If I did want to play around that, I could have not swung with the pacifista the last turn, but that's okay. He swings with Luffy, I got a Red Rock. Passes turn, and I could use that Red Rock to send his 10 drop 
back to the bottom deck. Four down left, I'm just gonna swing life. 7,000 with Soka King. Let's get an event card out of him, or he just takes life. He's gonna take the life and play out another Missile Sunday. So just a steady stream of blockers. He does have the option to not attack at all and just build board. Let's see if he has another 10 drop. He does not. So there attaches one to leader, 6,000. Probably to a pacifista. 7,000. I'm going to block and get that red rock back in hand. Blocker law. That's interesting. To take back the Luffy and then he hard plays an Uta. I think that might have been a misplay. He should have left the Luffy on board just for presence. Playing it out for 7 next turn will cost him a lot. So here I play out the Mihawk for 9, bottom decking the Uta just because it has the 1k counter, and using leader ability to bounce the law back to hand. He does have a Hell's Judgment, so blocks out of one pacifista attack, the other pacifista is 3,000 power, and now I get to swing with both leader and Cro leader and Soga King, netting him down to zero life. So this whole game's all about tempo. He's kind of been playing into my events as well as my bounce characters. So that's the Luffy that he picked up from last turn from the law. Cheated out the Nami to draw one. I guess if he left the Luffy there, I would have Mihawked it. But then he still would have had one more character on board. Two down left. He's just going to swing five with leader. That's an easy 1k counter. And he gets two more down back, so he has four down up potentially for two events. So now I have five attackers. I could just slowly scrape away at his hand and just go for game. So 9,000 with Mihawk. He's gonna block that with Luffy and restand it. So I'm like, okay, let's not have that happen again. I'm just gonna red rocket two down left and just swing 7,000. That's game. Thanks for watching.